No problem. No problem. I just record a little bit of your audio. You're sounding top shelf as usual. Sounding top shelf as usual, Motormouth Mall. You have a good one. 73 to you. 1250 Illinois Gator waving. There you go, Illinois Gator 1250 Motormouth Mall. Got you all up in here and you're sounding wall to wall and treetop tall. Super good. Around my neck in the woods, that's a dog on shore. Hey, 1250, I hope you got that playback. Motormouth Mall, step and break it. I should turn some of this bass down a little bit there like that. Hey, 1250, I'll turn the bass down just a little bit there for you. Motormouth Mall cruising. They got down right there, break on. Let me get in here and uh, talk on this radio a little bit. 951 checkpoint. Okay, sounds good. All right, well, I'll leave it up a little bit then. Bass is sounding good around your place. You, you never know what radio you're catering to, you know. Some radios have a pretty poor uh, ability to deal with the low frequencies, <laughs> and some of them work pretty good. And since I keep the highs rolled off really tight at 6 kilohertz right now, I was trying to keep them at about 5. But then with all this hype about I'm trying to be wide, narrow, this, that, and the other, I said, screw it, I'm going to go six. <laughs> and, that, and if they complain a little bit more, I'll go ten to break. Sounds good. Take care of 73's at 1250. Uh, Illinois Gator, have a good day. Appreciate the bump down in the world, uh, in the world of sound. Appreciate the QSO. And, uh, man, you got to find sound a station out there, by the way. I love it. Sounds good, smooth, good audio, and uh, rocking and rolling. And hello to you out there, 1274, uh, I mean, uh, 274. Hi, Stepper. I heard you uh, roll up in there, too. They're breaking. I didn't. I didn't get out here until kind of late in the day because I went up this morning to uh, San Luis Obispo and I picked up a little uh, 1980 Mercedes uh, 240D and uh, really clean conditions. And so anyway, I got it. And uh, uh, so anyway, then I would did some work over here in the shop and uh, move some things around. And uh, anyway, decided to finally sit back and, and get a minute or two of radio time in there before I called the quits. The break. One sitting in the trees. Well, you know what's really cool about it? I, I, I was I was pretty sure I was going to get it no matter what, you know, because it's just a good little car and uh, really good condition and the price was right and everything else. But uh, when I looked under the hood, I didn't realize how much space there was under the hood. And uh, so, you know, out here in California, diesels are exempt, you know, from 1996 and before from smog. And uh, gasoline is exempt at 75 and before. And anyway, this is a little 80, and, and, and then, so anyway, I figure, well, since it's exempt, if anything ever happened to it, I could always convert it to a, you know, a, a gas uh, V8 supercharged or, 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 or a turbocharged uh, V8, you know, small block of aluminum 350 or 383 or something like that, you know, and that it'd be kind of cool to change the transmission out in the rear end. But anyway, um, it, it was a, it's, it's just a good project car, if, if anything, down to the future. But in the meantime, it's perfect, just as, as it is, the break. Well, you got a point there, but no, the Chevelle was, uh, like I said, this isn't going to be any kind of a project any kind of, anytime soon. But yeah, you're right, the Chevelle, man, that, uh, <laughs> that would have been the one to keep. I keep thinking I heard a mouse, a mouse in the background. It must have been a chair or something. I thought I heard something squeak, and I was like, no, a mouse doesn't squeak that loud. But anyway, uh, yeah, no, it is a good little car. It's something fun, another one to add to the collection to break. Ha, ha, ha. 
<laughs> ten four. Uh, it could have been, but you, I, I don't think you're sweeping to, to, uh, you're making the trip just fine over here. So, anyway, all right, sounds good. Catch you later on 73. So, I want to get back out of here and uh, I have, have my fun. And it looks like Mother Nature might be on the move a little bit there. And I know there's a bunch of other stations out there that want to continue doing their thing out there on the west side. So, I'm going to get out of the middle of the road, say 73 square. I spoke up, Motormouth Mall, Stephanie. Big Dog Liberty, take care of 73s. Upper on Missouri, Motormouth Mall, stepping.